Hey guys, I'm in Walmart. Let's go and see the exotic angel plant. They have a lot of these guys. I can give you the na name of these Sunny Star Croton. And this is the Petra Croton. There is some Sunny Star already dead. And some Petra already dead. This one is fine. Bush on Fire Croton. We call this Manok Manok in the Philippines. Alright, some Sensiberia. And by the way, all of these small pots like this is uh, $3.48. Some little Sensiberia. By the way, Sensiberia is Dracinia now. Let's go to the other side here. A very nice Monstera Deliciosa for uh, 25 bucks. And Majestic Palm. All of these are 25 bucks here. Look at this one, it's a cane plant, almost dying. And some really nice baby Monstera for 12 bucks. I'm not gonna show the dead one, guys, so we won't feel bad right now. That's a nice Monstera, guys. 25 bucks. Oh, look at this ponytail, almost dead. Somebody beat them up. There's one here for 13 bucks. Calatia zebra plant. Looks really good, huh? For 13 bucks. That is a pretty one. Very pretty. Let's just arrange here because we don't want the other plants to die but this one is so beautiful it's just smashed on the front and they have a lot of small orchids for how much ten dollars I was thinking getting orchids this year and uh, I'm gonna collect different kinds when they're on sale. That will be my goal. And the rest is almost dead. We will not gonna touch it. But look at these guys. I think this is part Laurenti. For 25 bucks. Nice variegation, huh? They still have the moon shine. I think this is the moon shine philodendron. Correct me if I'm wrong, okay? And um, there's no price. Of course, I have to show my face, huh? <laughs> Look at this, uh, Ontorium with the fake lips. Why do you have to put the fake lips? This is fake! And they just put it like that. I'm so sad. And there's almost dead um, money plant. 
and then those things are totally dead this is my favorite chair i think i i show it last time 329 bucks it's pretty cute as i am in uh, home depot They have um, alocasia. Did I ask? Did I make it like alocasia? Did I say alocasia? There. Bella Jurassic alocasia. Because the patty has like a Jurassic Park, Ju Jurassic footprint, <laughs> not like a park. And all of that for one pot for 19 bucks. 19.98. CC plants for uh, 13 bucks. Bromelets for 15 bucks. And some succulent. I don't know how much. 8 bucks. And a little of this thing. Ontorium. I don't know how much the price. Let me see. Why expensive? 15 bucks? What? Bromelets. This one needs water on the middle. And there's a lot of bromelets here. Polka dots. Pink polka dots. And look at this one. Oh, I need to. Nice, huh? Caladium for 13 bucks. Pretty. Lots of flowering pot. Kalakoi. And I do not know the price. So cute. I like the red. Okay. Kalokasha. Alokasha. This one is so pretty. You know, in my house, there's really low humidity. All of them are dying. You need a humidifier. Look at all of these nice orchids. Beautiful. Guys, look at this. Venus trap. They have so much and I'm sure this flower is for the outside for outdoor star lavender cane plants Look at that, I am at the succulent and I do not have little samurai guys. Eight bucks? What? Oh, it's so cute. It's so small. See? They have a couple. one you know this one doesn't need a lot of light but don't put it also in the dark it also needs some light look at this one there's a little boat 
Look at the plants, guys. Golden photos. And these are little orchids. There is the nice flag of United States. Oh, look at the pot. Oh my God. So cute. The pot, the pot. I only want the pot. Okay, I'm gonna go and get, uh, not get, I'm gonna show you the other pot. Look at the other pot, pot the pink one. <gasps> And this one is almost violent. Oh my gosh. This is the only one that has flag. All of them are so small. Look at this. This is always in Hawaii. Tropical jewel, princesa. I said this is always look like Hawaii, not in Hawaii. We have like this in the Philippines too. 20 bucks. Why so expensive? Goodness. Okay. All right, so pineapples, CC plants, Birkin almost dying and um wow they have some um philodendron here there is some also inside okay Alocasia. It, this is one. This one is big. Taniki. And some of these. Look at that. Lilies. It needs water. Starter plants. Peperomia. Some starter plants here. English ivy. Bird nest. Somebody squish it. Um, snake plants and lots of birkins. And that's it. They also have lots of CZs and some potting mix for orchids. Guys, I am in um, Costco. This is for 22 bucks. Star lilies, my favorite. I think I'm gonna buy one. Mmm, smells so good. Alright, I'm trying to find um, a better one. I think I'm gonna get this one. buy them all can you see how beautiful is this wow well, I don't know what is this let's see Dahlia it's pretty huh but I got two of these lilies is it too much? <laughs> I don't care. 
this one is already open. Hi guys, I'm just showing you some of the plants here in the Philippines. This is the bird nest, not bird nest of paradise, it's a bird of paradise. I'm always mixing it up. Bird of paradise, but this one is variegated. I have to go there to show you the leaves. But my focus here is just to show you this stingray alocasia. I don't know if this is a stingray alocasia in the States or a stingray alocasia here in the Philippines where the island I am from. Can you see? It's really like a stingray, huh? But it's variegated. I saw the stingray alocasia non-variegated one. I have it in the house, but it died. But this one is just outside the house. This one is an old leaves here, but this one is the new leaves. It's so pretty it's really like a stingray with a little bit of you know lo those like a little uh spigot of water that you can put here but it looks like a stingray especially this one so tell me what's the real name of this i can research it the uh, I can research it if you want and I'll just put the name in the description you know sometimes it's so difficult to um, edit raw video from the Philippines Wi-Fi here is on and off it's not as fast I would say but um, it's just me complaining about the Wi-Fi here. Complain where I was, where I am living in the States. But you know, guys, the only thing that I really like in the Philippines, everything grows outside the garden. This is one of my favorite plant now. I, I wish I can bring it at home. Look at the tail. It's really a stingray, huh? But beautiful variegation around it. It's almost camouflage. And of course, there's a lot of aglionemas. And my cell phone just turned low, but low battery let makes it so fast let's make this video so fast there's another aglionimas there's a red aglionima here and that one too and on the bottom here this is um i would call this uh orchid Oh, they have, yeah. And um, there's a lot of aglionimas there. And um, exotic, exotica, philodendrum exotica. I have this at home. And some monstera here. I think this one needs a light a little bit. And I think is this is the philodendron. I don't think this is the sanado. It looks like the uh, saber tooth. Not saber tooth, but I will do correction, guys. When I go back to the states right now, I am 
in the Philippines visiting my dad. I'm just um, by their garden. This is philodendron and this is a beautiful ontorium with a lot of flowers. Look at the seeds of this ontorium guy, guys. And I believe this is the ontorium bird nest. I believe, okay? Don't yell or scream. It's the wrong name. Look at the flower. If I put my hands here, it's huge, guys. It looks like plastic. It feels like plastic. Forgive my finger, okay? Because I've been gardening. There. It's huge. And Adazonii. And then Black Velvet. And look at the back of the Black Velvet guy. I don't know if this is the Black Velvet. But because the, re the back one is red. It's almost bloody red, purpley. They just leave it here on the ground. Well, it's not on the ground, it's on the pot. And then if we go to the other side, let me go to the other side here. There is an ontorium and um, just other, like this one is the prayer plant. And um, I won't tell all the names, guys. I'm just showing you. And I'm so I'm sure this is the Silver Bay. There is a lot of plants here that I don't have. And look at this. This is um, um, bamboo. And then this is kind of palm. Some. I believe this is uh, the regular, I think this is the gray alocasia scale, um, dragon scale. I'm not sure. A lot of prayer plants. And Defenbachia. Pray, um, just some roses and then African mask this one is a different kind of African mask it's more skinnier and grayish and all of their all of on the back is just a vegetable You know, most of these plants, they grow um, wild in our farm. They just took it from the ground there. And this is the just a regular bird of paradise. That's it for now. So this is the variegated bird of paradise. I never seen this in the States. Just imagine, huh? We have this. I think they have this in... In... Um, what you say it? Florida. And there's still some plants on the top there uh, when I have time I'm gonna show you when I have time it's like I'm very important huh <laughs> I always tell my dad I am an important person that please 
Don't bother me right now. Important person do important things, huh? Like meandering around plants. I really like this one. I wish I can bring this to the States. This one? Oh my god, it's so beautiful, guys. Just imagine you have that on front of your house or inside your inside your house it's so pretty it's so big and it's almost like unreal all right i hope guys you like it my little house plant tour So there's another plant here. I don't know. I never seen this in the States. It looks like, um, I think this is from Alokasha family. I'm not sure. It's nice, huh? Look at this. When it's get matured, it become like this color. When it's, uh, still young it will be lo looking like this and there's some babies here and this is the ontorium again the mommy ontorium you saw that uh big ontorium it was taken from this one this is the mommy one they took it from here So this is the mommy one and that is there, the baby. Mommy looks small, huh? But the baby looks big. It's nourish, nourish in that area. Look at that um, native home in the Philippines and this one guys that's where they cook uh, fresh coconut and they sell the meat of the coconut in the oil company Copra yeah Copra business I'm gonna go there and check it out, okay? Where do you want video? Where do you want video? Where do you video? Where do you want video? So, what's your name? Samuel. 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 Huh? Samuel. Samuel. This is Samuel. Is it Bordoy? Bordoy? So Bordoy is the owner of this um, Copra and this is the son. This is their small business. So they cook they cook the they cook fresh coconut like this and they smoke it for whole day. They cook this one and um, they will smoke it whole day and whole night and sell it to the oil company to make this uh, coconut oil. They get coconuts from all the coconut trees and this is the coconut husk. Oh? They put some fire. Look at that. They use the coconut husk. 
and then cook the coconut. Thank you, sir. Ahmad. Ahmad. Oh? Ahmad. Tasa ka tubo no, te Ahmad? Si. He is working and he is getting the coconut husk. Bye, Ahmad. Look at the little kid, huh? He is carrying in that. Makawan, man group. Carabu. 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 Carabu.